So what is DCM, or degenerative cervical myelopathy? Well, it arises when arthritic changes in the spine compress and injure the spinal cord. This is a healthy spine. The spinal cord is your junction box of the nervous system. It's there to communicate information from the brain to the body and from the body back to the brain. And it sits protected inside your spine, which is made up of bones and ligaments to offer both strength and support, but also flexibility. So as you can see in a healthy spine, there's lots of space around the spinal cord. However, in degenerative cervical myelopathy, or DCM, wear and tear changes to the spine, such as bone spurs called osteophytes, or changes to the discs that can slip or prolapse, or changes to the ligament which can thicken, or changes to the alignment of the bones called listhesis, can lead to compression and injury of the spinal cord. And this is DCM. Today, we largely rely on MRI to diagnose DCM. And here is an example of a healthy spine. You can see the spinal cord is framed in the white of the brain fluid, and this is normal. Here is the MRI of somebody with DCM, and you can see that the spinal cord is being compressed, that the white frame of brain fluid has been lost. If you have any questions about DCM, and want to find out more, please visit myelopathy.org for accurate and up-to-date information and a community to support you.